Greg wants to rent a stand at a flea market to sell old video game cartridges. He plans to acquire games for $4 each from an online auction site, then sell them for $12 each. The cost of renting the stand is $160 for the day. Using function operations, derive functions for revenue, R of n, expenses, E of n, and profit, P of n. Graph each function. The revenue is the total amount of money brought in from sales. If Greg sells n games for $12 each, the revenue function is R of n equals 12n. If Greg acquires games for $4 each and spends $160 to rent the stand, his expenses are E of n equals 4n plus 160. Greg's profit can be found by subtracting expenses from total revenue. The profit function is P of n equals 8n minus 160. Now we'll graph the three functions. First graph the revenue function. Next graph the expenses function. Finally, graph the profit function. Remember, the profit function is found by subtracting expenses from revenue. Now we'll move on to part B. What is Greg's profit if he sells 52 games? Begin with the profit function, p of n equals 8n minus 160. If Greg sells 52 games, replace the function input n with 52. p at 52 equals 256. When 52 games are sold, the profit is $256. Now we'll move on to part C. How many games must Greg sell to break even? The break-even point occurs when the profit is zero. We could represent this with the equation p of n equals zero. Replace p of n with 8n minus 160. Isolate the term with n on the left side. Divide both sides by 8 to get n equals 20. Greg will break even when he sells 20 games.